Hey, this is Nolan with Poe Productions, and we're doing some testing on some PQ Labs G4 overlays for a customer right now. I thought I'd do a quick overview here so you guys could have an idea of how these things go together. So basically there's an SD card like looking connection here as you can see and it slots right into the frame. There's three sides like this and one side that doesn't have the connection. USB and power coming out. These are the frames They come in a long slender box like you see here. The glass comes in a very large flat box like this. We're also testing the touch frames for the customer here. As you can see, we have a projection screen set up on one of our office partitions with some of our rear projection gray film on it. Computer and projector are in the other room, USB and power going into the frame here. And you can see that the image is smaller than the touch frame, which is okay. You always want the image equal to or smaller in size than the length and width of the active area inside the touch frame. Uh, the touch frame is a G4, so it's a quarter inch thickness. The G4S is an eighth of an inch, so it's half as thin. Four millimeter versus eight millimeter. You can see my finger there it is a little bit bigger and thicker than the uh, quarter inch G4 overlay here. We're using it without the glass that comes with the frame. We're just putting it onto our window here. Uh, we got paint running here. These are only two touch point frames, um, but very, very quick in terms of response time. Uh, just to give you an idea of what the driver looks like here, this is the driver page. Uh, different settings, you can see it has a serial number there, it's got a two touch point, uh, different things that you can set up, whether for TUI support, flash TUI, double click, nightclub, all these kind of things. Uh, launch Windows starts, etc, etc. Scan rate, you can, you can adjust as needed if you need it to be uh, much faster. Um, and the biggest thing that most people will run when they're on here is a calibration screen. Um, don't touch the screen while it clears all the touch screen data. And we're going to be coming to the black window here where it says touch plus for more than one second. And this is how you calibrate these touch frames. This is why it doesn't care if the image is smaller than the frame. Is as soon as you run this calibration, you are not going to need to know roughly how big it is. The computer automatically calculates it. So it doesn't care how big the image is. These X put the image exactly where the touch frame knows it is and that's how you get the calibration. So, two touch points, 55 inch screen here, didn't say that. Uh, these are 55 inch touch frames and I'm probably running a, eh, it's about a 55 inch image, cropped on a little bit on the left and right. But anyways, so that's how these frames go together. Real simple, less than five minutes setup. Uh, power USB into the computer in the other room. And again, the four sides that you simply put together very easily um, and in the box, it'll be a long, slender, disassembled frame set up here. There's the driver install CD that it comes with and the various accessories, uh, USB cable, power cable, screws to assemble it on the side, etc., etc. That's been a look at these uh, G4 frames from PQ Labs that we're setting up for a customer. And if you have any other questions, please contact us. These are really great frames, less than a five minute setup, installed on an office window, uh, anything shop window any of your monitors will work uh, you just put the touch frame and the included glass that comes in the long flat package uh, right onto your monitor very easy install